Hello everyone, it's your girl me Viva and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to my city living LP. This is part seven, I believe. So and look at this weirdo walking by, just interrupting the intro. Look at you. Do something with yourself. Anyways, yeah, so welcome back to my city living LP. And it's the next day. We're looking at Kaiser right here doing something that you would normally see Blaze doing. But he is currently working from home. I'm gonna have him and Blaze to work from home today because they both work today. And Milani, she is off. So what Kaiser is doing for his job, he has to paint a political mural. So that's what he's doing. He might be out here all day doing that I don't know and the last thing he has to do is he has to paint not paint he has to joke about politicians and also he got a promotion uh, if I could find it so yeah Kaiser he's been promoted to social justice worker he is now making an additional 13 simoleons per hour for a grand total of 39 simoleons per hour and he received a bonus of 275 simoleons he has check calls progress interaction on the computer and he has a new create a sim clothes and stuff so yeah kaiser got a promotion so what level is he now he is level three i thought it was a little bit further than that but i guess we're not and we're gonna have blaze to work from home as well he's playing video games he is a beat promoter. Did he get a promotion last part? I don't remember. But what he had to do, he had to spray graffiti for two hours and recommend hangouts to three sims. So we're going to try to do that while Kaiser is doing this because I'm pretty sure it might take him a little while. So let's look at Blaze here. Milani, I don't know what she is doing. Let's actually have her. She probably chatting. She chatting with somebody. Let's have her update her social media. She's going to do that instead of chatting with whoever. And Blaze is going to recommend a hangout for her. And she's going to share an image. And then she should be good. So what's going on now? I missed what it said. It went away a little too fast. But come on, Blaze. You you need to um, compliment her outfit. They all got new outfits today. She now has 200 and fast because it is early in the morning. And, um... How do we do it again? Is it under friendly? Yeah, recommend hangout. Gonna recommend a nightclub to her. So sure. Blaze has a new outfit as well. Looking cute as ever. Today we're going to the romance festival, I believe. I forgot what time it starts. I think it's like five. So I'm trying to hoping trying to and hoping that i could get them to finish their jobs for the day before that happens so we could just go out and hang out at the romance festival so you need to go outside and talk to some people you need to spray graffiti but uh let's not worry about that right now who can you talk to out here anybody interesting first of all i mean it doesn't really matter but if we're going to talk to somebody. Oh, here goes Nikita. So let's um just like stop her real quick. Like, hey, girl. Uh, hey, we was hanging out last night. So um, we're just going to recommend a hangout. Let's recommend a bar to her. Hopefully he catches her. I don't know. But Milani, she's just chilling on social media or whatever she's doing. She don't have to work today, which is great. But in the meantime, we're going to have her to work on another skill, which is singing. I want her to also sing. So also that and possibly, I don't know, we're just going to have her to sing. So she's going to practice singing. Let's listen to Milani sing. She sound horrible. It's going to take us a while, but we get in there. But she got a new hair, y'all. Look at that hair. She looking cute with that hair and that tattoo. Look at you, girl. We're not going to stay on her too long because she sound awful. <laughs> Just totally awful. Did he do it? That should be too. Okay, stop talking to her. You could talk to her later. I was about to say, what happened to your hair? <laughs> um, we just need to talk to one more person. Why not this guy? Because he's like right there. So let's get him a friendly introduction. And then recommend a spot to him. And then he got spray graffiti for two hours. So I might make him do that in his room. Because like I said, I wanted him to do some graffiti on his um, 
wall in his room so we might do that but let's just recommend oh look at that kid that kid got pink hair i like you let's recommend a museum to him he seemed like he might like museums so let's just do that did we do it i don't think we did i just have a feeling that we didn't a museum wait come back here let's just get that out the way i don't think kaiser is done so we did that. Now he needs to just spray graffiti for two hours. So let's head on back up to the apartment where Milani is trying to sing Bless Her Heart. She sounds like, I don't know what. Um, I want to put it on this wall over here. I don't know how big it's going to be. So we're going to have to like move his bed and stuff just until he's done spray painting, I guess. So let's just move his his bed over here and I don't even know what it's under to be honest so I'm just going to is it this is this what I'm looking for I think it is so oh this is big wow I was not expecting that but, but that is cool I thought it was gonna be smaller than that but we're gonna have Blaze to come up here jog here actually Blaze and he's going to do it says to spray graffiti, so we're going to do graffiti, and he's just going to do that for his wall. Would that wall still show up? Yeah, okay. Okay, that's good. Milani, girl, you sounding terrible, but you got to work on it. Just keep on trying, baby. Keep on trying. <laughs> Let's watch Blaze do graffiti for a little bit. If he starts, he should have room because that's custom content. So this is so cool. Blaze get to finally do some graffiti in his room. And I'm pretty happy and excited about that. I don't know if Kaiser is done. I don't think he is. No. Stop chatting to that girl. She's making you take a lot longer. And Milani has reached level two in singing. So she can now sing a duet of pop songs with other sims. And she can also perform rock songs on the karaoke machine and folk songs via the piano, guitar, and or microphone. So she's she's getting there. It might take her a little while, but we try and blaze. Please don't spur your eyes out. Don't do it, boo. Don't do it. Let's check in on Kaiser real quick. It looked like Cassandra has joined us. This is really cute. I'm glad she's helping you. I didn't even think about that. I probably should have blaze too help him finish because this might take a while but it should take us to the romance festival hopefully i think it starts at like five i don't remember i should check but you know it's it's all good this takes a long time to paint this mural oh my gosh let's just speed it up a little bit because we've been out here all day like really all day let's check on blaze real quick see how he's doing is somebody here i thought i saw somebody i swear i did i'm tripping i'm tripping and blaze he has reached level three in the painting which is good look at this it's coming along pretty good i think kaiser finished it i think no what oh maybe that was for blaze yeah that was for blaze what we got going on every time the little text messages pop up they go away so i don't know what it said but it's from marcus i don't know what he want but blaze is done with his job for today it was pretty quick and easy so is he done with it no he's not done with it i swear i'm like seeing people oh i, I did okay why we haven't got our mail yet that's why i don't understand everybody else getting their mail but we not getting our mail so he's He's doing graffiti, but it's not showing anything right here. So that's why I thought he was, like, finished. But this looks pretty good. Pretty cool. You know, giving his room a little bit more personality to be like, okay, this is Blaze's room, you know? And Milani, she's still trying to sing. Oh, my gosh, girl. Oh, my. Do y'all hear this? It sounds like it's an echo. Girl, you have a lot to go. A lot to go. Your singing is not cute whatsoever. But Kaiser, he's almost done with the mural. So close to being done. I'm so proud of him. He did mainly most of this by himself. There goes Celine being all mad as always. I think he might got a little bit of an anger management problem. 
but we we're not gonna speak on that though <laughs> just hurry up guys and come on you're almost done boo get off our mural we asked you for help get out of here he's almost done now so you could like leave and we got it done finally great he's he's happy about that he is so proud of himself and i'm gonna be so mad oh he actually looked pretty daggone fine right here y'all let me take a picture Lord, good god okay <laughs> he's very happy about his mural and i'd be so mad if somebody like defaced it or something but he needs to also joke about politicians so we're just gonna pick this random person and try to get that interaction done and then he'll be done with work for today art style is activist painting how cute i wish we like could keep it forever but we can't um let's see we need to joke about politicians um yeah let's do that and get it done then we're done working for the day and we should be getting ready to go to the romance festival and having a good time who are you we don't want to talk to you and we're done goodbye we don't want to talk to you no more you are not cute i have a lot of makeovers that i still need to do that i have not done it's just Oh, it's a protest going on. Maybe we should join the protest because that's, like, what he likes to do, right? So, let's uh, join the protest because that's just what Kaiser do. <laughs> as we wait for the romance festival to get started. So, he might as well, you know? We give him some ideas for his next protest, I guess. So, he's just going to protest out here. <laughs> so cute i love kaiser like blaze may have a bigger fan base than kaiser but i love them both equally he do have a fan base it's just it's not big as blaze i don't know why but it's not <laughs> let's see how blaze is coming along my game is being a little weird today or oh, is our pipes leaking like why are they leaking Milani is still trying to sing. We're going to stop her because she is just putting a hurting on my ears. Just a big old hurting. Stop. Stop singing. Stop, girl. No. How about you uh, send some tech to Celine? Is this somebody else singing? Because I'm like, oh, my God, it sounds like an echo. But she stopped singing, but it's like I still hear it. Like, what the heck? Do y'all hear that? Maybe that's like the neighbors or something. That's weird. It needs to stop though. It needs to stop. <laughs> Let's see. No, like somebody's definitely still singing. I'm really mad right now. How about you call and chat with Celine? We're not going to invite him out to the romance festival because... They're just going to have fun. They're not going to have any dates or whatever. <laughs> so, um, should we try to attempt to repair it or should we just call the landlord? I think we should just call and complain to the landlord. So, I'm going to have Milani to do that. And we're going to read about the festival because I forgot um, what time it starts. But we're going to also read a note. Who's calling us? Who is it? Um, Nima is calling us. Um, Kaiser, it's me, Nima. Do you want to go out on a date? Oh, I'm sorry, Nima. Maybe next time if you ask again because we're about to go to the romance festival and we don't want to miss it because it's like the first time. So, um, maybe the next time. I'll have Kaiser to take her out on a date to get some coffee next time. I promise. If I forget, y'all make sure that I remember. <laughs> but, um, yeah, she's going to complain to the landlord. And we need to read a note on here and read about the festival. Because I think it starts at 5. And I just I want to be sure that it's at 5. So, let's see. What do the notes say? Take the chance to meet your neighbors. We don't bite. Well, most of us. So I know that old one does. Yeah, it starts at 5. So in a little bit, it's going to start. Okay, good. So we're not missing it. So this she right here, she bites. 
we don't even want to get to know her not one bit she loves that computer she that's all she's doing let's check on kaiser i guess the protest is over with which is great we're about to go to this romance festival in a bit we're just waiting for it to start in a couple of seconds here uh, let's check on Blaze's progress with his graffiti on his wall. It's looking pretty damn good. I'm like, I'm proud of him. But he need to stop. Though. I don't know how to make him stop because it's not in the little queue. So that's weird. So we're just going to reset him. <laughs> and we're going to go to the romance festival as friends, of course. Of course. But, you know, you never know what may happen. Um, we're going to, why, I'm about to say why, <laughs> they not showing up, so we're going to go with Milani and Kaiser to the romance festival, and hopefully it's cool or whatever, um, I think there's like a love guru, right, so we're going to be talking with the love guru and finding out what's their potential love life looking like in the near future, because, oh, we don't know, <laughs> Here we are at the Romance Festival. I'm just pausing to give it some time to load. But look how cute this is. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. So I think it's like some type of tea that they could drink. They'll get them flirty and stuff. And we might do like some sparklers and stuff. But um, it depends on who shows up, depending on what the heck we're going to do. So... Let's uh, drink some of this tea over here. We're going to pour Sakura tea. I might be saying that all types are wrong, but we're going to go get some of this tea. And I think it makes them flirty and stuff. So whatever happen happens, it's because of the tea. <laughs> Nikita is calling. Nikita wants to go on a date with Blaze. Oh my gosh, all these girls want to go on dates with us. We're going to have Blaze to possibly take her out on a date too in the future. Just one day we're going to have like a date. Everybody just go on a date together like a big old group date. But I'm sorry, Nikita. We're not going to go there. It would be cool because it's turning nighttime and it's like, you know, the ghosts and stuff out there. So it's like a haunted maze or whatever. But next time, Nikita, we promise, make sure y'all don't let me forget in the comment section. But they're going to drink some of this tea. And we'll see what type of mood that they get. Look like they get like a pink aura around them, which is which is cool. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's it's whatever. They might be a little hungry now, so we might actually eat before we talk to the love guru. Who, yeah, the romance guru. I said love guru. Same thing, romance guru. Before we talk to her, we're just gonna drink our little tea. Oh my gosh, we just our phones are blowing up today. Somebody else want to go on a date? I don't know. It went away. <laughs> so, what is he doing? He already like, ooh, I see me a blazing that I like. She got to pee. Girl, go pee. You just you just ruining the whole thing. Go pee, dude. Anybody else got to go pee? Everybody go pee. <laughs> Everybody got to take a potty break as soon as we get here to the festival. Everybody go pee. But I wanted to read the mood lit. So, it says... Botanic fragrance from the Sakura tea, the lovely scent of cherry blossoms can really get someone in the mood. And do we got anything else? She's just feeling good. Petals everywhere for being showered in puddle in puddles. <laughs> in petals. She was showered in petals. What? I don't even know what the heck is going on. But uh, let's see. Oh my gosh. Our phones are just blowing up today. Normally, nobody ever, like, hit us up. But should we go to the love? I keep saying the love. Should we go to the romance guru and ask her about stuff first? So, we're going to have Blaze to go first. He's going to, um, let's see, ask about your romance destiny. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> let's just see what that's about. Oh, she threw petals at him. I guess that's what that guy did to her, but I missed it. So we're going to have Blaze to ask about his romantic destiny and see what the romance guru has to say and see what Blaze's love life looks for. Oh, they just getting it in. Okay. All right. They really feeling the romance here. Let's see what she says. 
It'd be crazy to be like, you're meant to be single all your life. That would be really funny. Did she say that? Let's see. You are sure to find your destiny soon. Could that be a sign? Look at him like, oh, yeah, Roman Skiru. You know what you're talking about, girl. That could be a sign. Love for Blaze might be coming really, really soon. And we don't know when or how that might happen. But um, we're going to have Milani to do the same, ask about her romantic destiny. And we're going to have Kaiser just to drink some more tea real quick. And Blaze, you drink some more tea. Because, like, why not? And then after I get all of their little romantic destinies done, we're going to eat and just chill out. Because I'm not seeing anybody uh, really attractive for them at the moment. We just here. It seems like you could paint and stuff. So maybe Blaze would do that or maybe not. But it looks like you could also get married here but we're not getting married at the moment <laughs> not yet it's a little too early so let's see what she says for milani it said <laughs> i love her face she is so cute i love milani look at her but i'm trying to read what it said it said vibrations show a tall dark stranger in your near future a tall dark stranger only tall dark stranger i know i'm just saying <laughs> anyways uh thank you romance guru now it's kaiser's turn to see what she says for him and we need to start eating so let's start eating let's have milani to order she's gonna get what's good what's vegetarian safe it's ramen no should we get the puffer fish? I'm scared like they're gonna like die or something, but none of that is vegetarian safe. But this dango, hopefully I'm saying that right because she is a vegetarian. So then Blaze, he could order him something. He could have the ramen, I guess. But let's see what the romance guru has to say for Kaiser. This is pretty cool that we could talk to a romance guru, which is cool. But uh, I think it's like some special interactions as well that I might do in a bit. But, you know, some things might happen. They all feeling flirty. They might start flirting with one another. But let's see what the romance guru has to say for Kaiser first. Let's, let's just see. Blaze is using chopsticks. So it seems like he's having a difficult time with that. But what do you say about Kaiser? A tall, dark stranger in his future, too. Could be Nemo. Who knows? We're going to get him some food. He can have some ramen as well. As we just chill and see what's going on around here. Milani, did you eat? Did you eat already? She's throwing all the love. I keep saying love. The romance guru throwing. The romance guru threw petals at her which is pretty pretty cute i'm trying to see what else we could do um we should probably like buy stuff let's buy some swag let's haggle first and then buy swag let's see kaiser do you, are you getting your food order food get your ramen please oh he gave it to her like oh girl you is you pretty you pretty fine so i i'll give it to you <laughs> so let's see let's uh buy some discounted items and we're gonna actually do like some fireworks and sparklers and stuff but milani will be a kid and she'll buy some bubbles <laughs> um a roman candle What's a spark fountain? Let's do the spark fountain. Let's get like three of those. And I think we might have some sparklers, but I don't really, I'm not sure. But let's just get three of those as well. So, But she will be a kid and blow some bubbles because that's just Milani for you. So we're going to have her to go here. And she's going to blow her bubbles. And she's going to share her little thing with everybody. But she's going to blow some bubbles. <laughs> Because she's a big kid at heart, which is cool with me. Kaiser, what are you doing? Eat. 
He doesn't want to eat. What are you doing? Blow your bubbles, girl. Blow bubbles. Where are you going? Are you going to sit down and do it? I didn't know you could sit down and do it. <laughs> I don't know what she's doing. She don't know what she want to do. She's just so flirty. She she doesn't know what to do. <laughs> Blow your bubbles. I just want to see you do that. You're making it so difficult. You don't want to blow your bubbles? No? No? Okay, I guess she would not be blowing bubbles today because she is being crazy. Like, too crazy. But we're going to just start playing with our sparklers and stuff. I want to get him the romance one, so we're going to get him one, and they both going to play with sparklers, hopefully. Shoot, I get him the, all of them. <laughs> I meant to give him one, give one back to Milani. We're going to play with our sparklers and just see how they react to it. So cute, look at them. Even though she couldn't blow her bubbles. Uh oh, is, is she cheating? Is she cheating? Cause he got mad. Uh oh, this seems like this is a uh, episode four <laughs> for Jerry. Oh my gosh, like it's not their fault. It's the tea, man. It's the tea. But let's watch them play with their sparklers. Blaze just looking at it like I don't know what to do with this thing. <laughs> But it's a cute little place. It would be better if we were actually... Oh, he's definitely going after her. If we were, like, trying to... Um, oh, mention Flirty Festival vibe with Milani. <laughs> She's throwing petals at Blaze, too. I forgot what I was saying. I, oh, yeah. I was trying to say is that this would be a lot better if... He describing a flirty dream to Milani. If one of them were going to get married or were in that, um, you know, that situation that they could possibly marry somebody. Even if it was just like a uh, heat of the moment type of thing. But he's going to throw some petals at Milani. It's something about this tea that's getting to Kaiser right now. And maybe it's sparking back up these old feelings that he used to have for Milani back when they were kids. In case y'all didn't know, they grew up as friends for, you know, years and years and years. They went to middle school together. They went to high school together. They just, hold on, let me see something. I feel like I don't have my autonomy on and that's why they acting crazy. No, it's on full. Well, is that's what they want to do. But as I was saying, we're going to get, um, Blaze, how about you? Let's see here. You're going to mess with this, the street performer. Watch the living statue. Let Kaiser kind of do his thing over here. He just built up some liquid courage from this tea that's making him act this way. <laughs> but as I was saying, they have been friends for years. Like I said, they grew up together. And he always kind of had a slight crush on Milani, you know. And I didn't mean for it to be together. I'm so sorry. And, you know, he just... He never had the courage to just, like, go for it, you know, because he just, he just, I can't explain it. He just gets a little nervous when he's around Milani, you know, and those things are coming back up. So he's just going to compliment her appearance. And I'm going to have them to uh, take a picture together, but he's just going to try to you know, flirt with her a little bit and hold her hands. I bet y'all didn't think any of this was going to happen, did y'all? <laughs> Compliment her appearance. I think I probably already did that, but I'm not really sure. Y'all probably didn't know that Kaiser had a thing for Milani now, did y'all? <laughs> did y'all? Should they like kiss though? That is the thing. It could be like they wake up the next morning be like, oh, my God, what did we just do? That's kind of weird because we've been friends for so long. But, you know, you you just don't know. <laughs> you, you just don't know. Declare heat of the moment passion. Oh, my goodness. 
But she's like, I'm trying to talk to Salim. And he just like, forget Salim. He never really liked her. Look at him, professing his long love for her since like middle school. And she just eating it all up, eating it all up. Um, let's see. They should just like hold hands and stuff. He's just gonna be really romantic. And he's going to, I thought he could like give her a rose. I think we probably passed that point. And they just gonna like, um, he's gonna embrace her, see if she takes it. And then we're gonna light some fireworks and then we're gonna end it because I think the festival is gonna be ending. But they definitely gonna have like their first kiss. Oh shoot, <laughs> no, you saw that, that looked a little weird. Don't talk to Nikita, Nikita need to leave. I guess she's like, oh, so you couldn't go on a date with me, Blaze? You was here at the freaking romance festival without me? They just gonna go ahead and have their first kiss, y'all. I did not plan for this, but we're gonna see it happen right here and how it unfolds. Blame it on the tea, y'all. Blame it on the tea. I paused because I need to take a picture of this moment. Milani is so caught off guard. She don't know where is this coming from, from Kaiser. Like, what is this all about? Oh, my goodness. Like, like what is happening right now? <laughs> she, she liked it, though. Look at her. Look at her. Look how she's standing. They need to take a picture together. Let's do that. And then we're going to set off these fire... Um, works. Take a photo with Milani. Blaze, he's just over there kicking and he don't care about nothing. <laughs> he wants to get dazed a little bit, but we're not going to do that this part. We're just going to see, um, this unfold. And look at them cutie pies. Um, we should probably brighten it a little bit, though. Um, uh, which one is bright in this one? <laughs> I was like, which one is it? Look at them cute. We're definitely going to hang that on the wall. They probably would not remember this in the morning because this tea has like drugged them. But Blaze, what you doing? Come here. Come here. Um, go here, please. And give Kaiser his spark over. That would be great for you to do. And he's going to just play with it. And I think Milani still have the thing. Yes, yeah, she did. Romance guru, like, girl, see, I told you. Tall and dark, tall and dark, girl. I saw you over here getting your life, girl. <laughs> the romance guru is funny, y'all. Let's, uh, can we place them? Placing world and light at the same time? Okay. Just do all of them. I think it'll do all of them. Would it? No, don't do it, girl. <laughs> Just, uh... Place them in the world then. Don't light it. No, she's going to light it. Darn it. I said don't. Don't light it. And you lit it anyway. You lit it anyway. It's okay. Let's see what it looks like. Will it go up? What's wrong, Blaze? Why are you embarrassed? I don't know. Is that all that it does? I'm not really sure light it i thought it was gonna like explode darn it we might got the wrong ones i see you over there getting y'all life everybody's a little scared i guess <laughs> of the fireworks i'm not really sure i guess everybody was a little scared but it didn't do anything i think we got the wrong ones so we need to buy some different ones because they're not like going up they just like sparking or whatever blaze I need you to buy the other ones really, really quickly and see if we could get the right ones. Because these are not the right ones, even though they're cute and all these are not the right ones. So, we're going to have Kaiser. He's still going to flirt with her a little bit from afar. <laughs> I was about to say apar. What is apar? Oh, my gosh. I cannot speak tonight. And he's going to a little bit blaze get the right stuff blaze hurry up buy some swag we need to get the right fireworks so that was um, i don't even know which one that was that we got but let's get 
Okay, this one goes up in the sky. So let's get like three of these. We're wasting money. <laughs> Blaze is going to come here and do it. Look at these two flirting back and forth. Cutie pies. I love them. They should like just go woohoo, right? We should do it. We should do it just to spur the moment. They're going to woohoo. <laughs> but that'll probably be next part. We'll continue from here next part. But I think this video is getting a little too long. So we're going to place these in the world. And we're going to light them. Place it in the world. We all need to know that you want to take your underwear off. <laughs> that daggone wicked woohoo mod. And we're going to light them. I think it lights all of them, but I'm not really sure. Blaze is so tired. Let's just see what happens. There we go, y'all. Finally, to end the romance festival. I think it was only one. So Blaze did one. I'm going to have Milani to do one. And Kaiser do one. Light them up. Light them up. Let's see. Cute. Where's your Kaiser? I was about to say, where is yours? Oh my gosh. And there we go, y'all. Ending the romance festival in a little bit of style. I'm gonna have him throw petals at her one more time and down the end of part right here because I'm sure it's like super long. <laughs> so we're just gonna end the part right here. So I hope y'all enjoyed this part. Like I said, we will be continuing from this moment, the next part. And maybe Kaiser and Milani might have a spur of the moment. Woohoo. Who knows after all these years of them being friends that the romance festival made all of this come out of Kaiser. <laughs> Who knows? I don't I don't know. But uh let me know what you think about Kaiser and Milani. And also don't forget to follow Blaze here. He's looking pretty sad because he's tired. Follow him on Instagram. It'll be down in the description at just Blaze. And uh yeah, like this video up if you haven't already and subscribe to my channel if you're new. Follow all those links down below and I will see you on my next video. Bye.